my first wick trimmed up the way that it should be and then the other side of that that I already trimmed off I basically cut it to length too and I'm just gonna set it on top of that so we know enough about cotton probably by now to know that the cotton will expand when it gets wet but it just don't expand enough okay and the silica we know it doesn't expand at all and this is where you leave the flooding and the gurgling behind and what you're doing is you are 100 percent closing up the holes the room for air to get in through there so now I have my first wick with some with some cotton inside of the coil and then I've got another piece of cotton on the top of the coil and I have a small coil that is not going to touch the sides it's not going to touch the cap it's completely covered by the cotton on the top and I have set that all down on top of the coil okay this is the success right here that I've had and as you can see there is plenty of cotton in there that it will wick until your heart's content if you're gonna go with low resistance go with low voltage or wattage if you go too high and you burn the cotton the cotton is gonna dissipate and then you're gonna have problems so if your cotton dissipates and you have problems don't fret just try it again try it with another wrap next time okay I use the AWG 30 I'm not so sure what gauge of needle this is it has the purple plastic on the end <clears throat> but I think that this needle tip is a pretty popular size I did six full wraps with AWG 30 and this should be about 1.5 or 1.6 ohms of resistance so that should work on a lot of things okay so let me go ahead and throw this thing together and let's see how much resistance we actually have let's go ahead and get it soaking with some liquid and let's see what we got going on okay you're putting this thing together don't forget to put that plastic piece back over the top there you know it's all a b c and d kind of stuff here but I've done the work and hopefully I'll be able to help some people out. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is check the resistance. I've, I do have 1.5 ohms of resistance. Okay, so that's pretty cool. I'm going to go ahead and start this puppy off at 7 watts. Still a little bit of wire yet. There is that break-in period, obviously, right? And the production will get better, too. All right, guys, that's it. That is uh, the fix. The fix is in. Thanks for watching.